finish the uh the Corilla or uh, yeah Corilla quest yeah I think that's f that's uh the pro the uh, the undercover cop mission I'm hoping my my audio sounds good for my mic because I don't have the pop filter on I'm just hoping it sounds really good because the pop filter kind of like I don't I I have a a pop filter I can wrap around the mic that came with the mic but I also have one that is like a traditional pop filter that is on a put opposable arm but that one really kind of like the heat from my breath bounces off of it just hits my face and it's just gross feeling so Okay, here we go. Did you get it yet? Adam, please. You have to get that security footage back. I got the footage. You owe me one, Tim. Yeah, you got that right, Jensen. I mean, thank you so much. This is my life I just got back. Here, there's the weapon mod, as promised. Listen. I know you were trying to do a good thing, and I respect that. But you should do it through proper channels. Next time you might not get this lucky. Yeah, you're right, Adam. I know you're right. Listen, thanks again. Okay, can we... Okay, cool. Well, I'm gonna be putting this on the pistol. Where is it? Where the hell is it? Oh. beans. Uh, which one now? Which quest is next? Which one's closer? Okay, well there's S4. S5 has a lot more to do. Or is, is a lot more in depth, I guess you could say. So, let me try this one. I thought that was a vent for a second. I was just like, what the hell? I can't believe this whole Oh, look who it is. I see you got my message, Cabrón. Sanders. You're taking a risk meeting this close to Seraph headquarters. Same risk as you, considering you're the one who let me go. But I don't plan to stick around that long. Yeah? So what's this about? I did some house cleaning after the plant. And I turned up some intel on a gearhead motherfucker who used me and my brother. Tink left the pocket secretary behind. Don't say who he was working for, but it's got access codes, names, shit like that. Why are you giving it to me? Maybe I don't like feeling like I owe you. Or maybe I figured I'd send a snake to kill a snake. Take or to leave it, Benejo. Either way, my debt is paid. Okay, cool. Well, that guy was pretty cool, except he's also an ass. And heck, the suit's in it. Let me save first. Guess I can't save when in something like that. Hack it. Okay, how in depth is it? Yeah, it's really in depth. So I'm just gonna have to bounce, bounce from here to okay. Come on. Access granted. Yay. Oh shit. That's sick. That can go right there. I don't know why that was all the way over there. But let me move this. Whoops. Fuck. I just wasted that, I'm pretty sure. Ok, 
Okay, well, like, that one was a good quest. That's very short, though. So, yeah. How much time do I have left? 23 minutes. Okay. I got a comment on one of my videos. I don't know what video, but, or even what channel. But, uh, yeah. But, uh, some guy was asking me about my, uh, specs and shit. I don't know what it's about, really. Let's see if, it's, if this guy sells. How may I be a Let me sell some stuff. That's if I have anything to sell. Nope. Uh, buy. Ooh. I'll buy this. What about anything over here? No. Um, I think that's about it. See you soon. So let's add this to the pistol. Cool beans. I wonder what's so close. That cat is so weird, but I like the sound of the cat meowing. Oh, okay. Okay, now where is this? It's above. Do I have a Praxis kit? I don't know if I do. Nope. Didn't think so. What's this? Pocket secretary. Let's look at the pocket secretary. One o two nine. I don't know why he had a bomb or whatever that was set up. I didn't take any of my health, luckily. Access granted. Cool. Something hidden back here. Package one package of drugs. Nice. Okay, so where do I go? Disconnect.
I really want to look up the passcode for this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Access granted. Yay. Not very much good stuff, but it was good enough. Okay. So where to now? Well, those are the only ones, so I guess just down. And here is the exit. I wonder why there's fucking screaming. Yeah, the dude's alive. I couldn't tell if he was alive or not. Oh well, I had the passcode to that thing the entire time. What? How much is left? 17 minutes left. So I'm going to try to make this worth it. That's a weird looking backdrop. Well, that's not even a real backdrop. That's terrible looking. That would probably be the only thing I had to say was that didn't hold up is some of that the interior stuff. Even though it does look really good, but... It, to me, it feels nostalgic, and it just reminds me of the past and whatnot. Hey, look, that dude's gone. I always hated that shit. Well, like, after a quest is over, certain guys or characters, they leave. I don't know, I just thought that was kind of lame. But whatever. But that, yeah, this game just reminds me of the past and some, some of my favorite times in my life. So, yeah. Really happy personal things. But, yeah. Let's get to, uh, S5, the, well, the closest one. Let's go kill some fucking gangsters. Is this... No, it's not something. My favorite thing about like, about gangsters is how they complain and pl like to pretend they're victims whenever they're the ones that are breaking the law and doing all kinds of shit they know they shouldn't be doing but they act like they're trying to survive, you know what I mean? It's just kind of stupid and pathetic to be honest. But I gotta get through the uh this electricity water, so I gotta go get these crates. This could probably take some time. I'm just gonna toss them. Okay, you didn't hit anyone. You would think these boxes would be conductive because they look metal, but I don't know why they're not really conductive. Look, they're not conductive. Grab, thank you. I'm gonna auto save or quick save. And this is how I did it the first time whenever I played this game.
Better safe than sorry. Candy bar. Yes? May I help you? Actually, I've been told by a mutual acquaintance that it might be the other way around. Were you followed? <laughs> Nervous, are we? Surely you understand I wasn't successful in this line of work for this long by being careless. So what is it you need? Straight to business, a rare quality these days. Tell me, are you familiar with local gangs? More than enough to get by. Perfect. Now I warn you this is not the cleanest of work, but your efforts will be well compensated. An associate of mine will leave a package for you in an alley on Grand River Road. You will retrieve this package and then use it to deal with a problem of mine. Permanently. Who's the target? Someone who won't be missed, I assure you. A ganger that goes by the name Double T. <laughs> Hangs around in an apartment near Earl's Court. It's not likely that he'll be alone. Just as it's not likely the people keeping him company will be of the pleasant sort. You can't miss him. He's got prominent and rather tasteless augmentations to his face and arms. You're telling me you went through all this trouble to hire me just so I can eliminate a banger? That would be a tad overkill, I admit. No. Eliminating the target with the weapon provided to you is only the first part of your assignment. Once you've dealt with Double T, I need you to sneak into Derelict Row and plant the murder weapon among the baller's weapon stash. Unnoticed. Kill a member of the Motor City Bangers, then plant the murder weapon in the rival gang's weapon stash. You're trying to start a war. Hopefully. So what's the plan? You make a call and rat one of the bangers out? Then the DRBs retaliate and so on and so forth until they wipe themselves out? Pretty much. What about innocent casualties? These thugs aren't exactly expert marksmen, and it's pretty hard to aim from the window of a moving car. What could be worth such a risk? I won't discuss my motives with you. I hired you to do a job. Just do it. I don't understand what you're getting out of this. It sounds to me like you're just the middleman for someone else. You think too much, my friend. This could prove to be a source of great personal discomfort for you in the near future. You don't sound like a cop. You, on the other hand, are starting to sound exactly like one. I strongly suggest you simply get on with the program. I need a more precise location on the target. There's a small back alley known to the locals as Earl's Court. You can access Double T's building using the fire escape. He's in one of the apartments on the fourth floor. Okay. I think we've gone there before. So what is it I'm picking up and where is it exactly? There's a rather luxurious apartment complex on Grand River Road. In front of it, on the other side of the street, you'll see a door that leads to a maintenance corridor. In the first corner of that corridor, you will find a crossbow hidden amongst the trash and debris. Use it to kill Double T. I can get inside Derelict Row, but where can I find their weapon stash? Look for an old concrete structure that is boarded up and condemned. I believe they stock their supplies right underneath it. Okay. I guess that's it for now. So what's next on the agenda? Locate the hideout, retrieve O'Malley's package, go to District Rolo, District Row, Duralect Road, whatever that's called. Remain undetected while in DRB territory. Okay. Hmm. I like how this area is still just open. It's kind of lame if you ask me. I wish that it was closed or something. Okay. So I think I'm going to end it right here. Um, it's already getting pretty low in my time. I'm all, 
I have eight minutes left, so I don't know what I can actually do in eight minutes, but considering there's gonna probably gonna be a lot of walking and whatnot. So uh yeah, I guess uh thanks for watching.